Hello everyone, welcome back to part 3 of a 4 part replay between Maxwell and Kaz here on Terranistan. Right now, Archmage, very very low on hit points. As you can tell by all those Dragonhawks, they've been taking a lot of Breath of Fires in the face. But they're still, they're still currently up and running. Mountain King is invisible. Oh, that is a very very bad sign for that poor pa Pandarian Brewmaster. Mountain King invisible does not have enough mana for a Stormbolt though. Oh, this is crystal critical, critical. Okay, gonna go ahead and get this game started right now. Mountain King trying to uh, chase down that Pandarian Brewmaster will not be able to chase him down as he has a boots of speed. Water Elemental trying to chase down, and that was actually very anticlimactic. Sorry. See, this is what happens when I have not seen the game before. So now a Death Knight now mo mo roaming around with a se level 7 Pandarian Brewmaster. We've seen the ultimate once or twice right now. A shade is in play, so we do know that there is an expansion in play right now. At, um, what we have a water mental trying to take down a single spirit tower is not going to work. Going to haunt that gold mine as soon as that water mental goes down. Wants to make sure that that um, gold mine does get back up right now. Maxwell down to 700 gold in his main gold mine, down to 280 gold over here. So expansions are going to be coming into play. Pandarian Brewmaster now coming in. Breath of Fire taking off all, taking out all so much damage right there, taking down so many units. Gonna get take down what one, two, three, four. Five, oh, is it gonna be five, five? And now getting a bolt for all of his effort. Pandarian Brewmaster very, very low on hit points. Breath of Fire and now using a Squirrel Town Portal, able to finish off a couple more peasants. So wow, able to completely clear out that gold mine in just a matter of seconds right now. Death Knight cannot heal that Pandarian Brewmaster, obviously. So the Pandarian Brewmaster just trying to get some love from those um, Obsidian statues and the Unholy Aura from that Death Knight right now. Pandaria Brewmaster once again trying to move back out. Perhaps the Brewmaster will head over here and try and head over to the Mercenary Shop. No, not heading over to the Mercenary Shop. Just kind of confused walking around the map right now. We have the main army getting healed back up with that Scroll of Regeneration. Shade following that Archmage around. Level 5 on the Archmage, level 3 on the Mountain King. So... Game would have been different as long as that Mountain King had a had a potion of mana, would have been able to take down that single unit. Still at keep right now, the towers towers are upgraded to the level one masonry upgrades, so they should be fairly easy to take down with destroyers right now. So it's destroyers against a Pandarian Brewmaster and Dragonhawks with an Archmage and a Mountain King. Right now, Kaz sitting at 48 over 84, Maxwell sitting at 47 over 100. So both players pretty much sitting at the same exact food count. Now trying to get some additional spirit towers into play. Three spirit towers going to be coming in. Acolytes, no, ghouls now heading out, not quite sure. Um, the gold mine has already gone over here. The acolytes are now moving out. So let's see what's gonna happen. Um, Mountain King getting to level four. So more bashing coming in from that Mountain King. Archmage, very, very low on hit points, 850, compared to the Mountain King's massive 1250 right now. Now we have the Acolytes haunting this gold mine. Three Spirit Towers in play. And now trying to take down some of these Spirit Towers. Those Spirit Towers are going to quickly get taken down. And now, not for some reason, no Cloud being researched. Cloud would be just absolutely critical in this game. Devour Magic coming in. Pandarian Brewmaster getting bolted once, once again. Trying to run away. Trying to run away. Ma Death Knight now trying to fo focus down some of those units. Single low hit point Spirit Tower in the front. And we have Ghouls in the base of Maxwell Demon just... Oh, and taking out all of that gold mine right now. So, um, Kaz or K Kaz has no additional way to get any additional gold from that expansion right now. Pretty much has what he has, and that's it. So we'll see how he's going to really play into the strategy right now. Gold mine getting rep um, the tower is getting repaired right now. Should probably be heading back onto that gold mine. Pandarian Brewmaster low on hit points. No, no way of really healing that Pandarian Brewmaster. Death Knight still sitting at level 2. Ghoul is going to be coming in and they're just going to fall to the, the Mountain King right now. The ghouls are trying to run past. Let's see if, uh, if it's really going to work out. Down goes one ghoul, another ghoul. Behind there is already going to fall as well. Down goes another ghoul, trying to take one more ghoul. And then um, what the last ghoul of Maximal now trying to run back into the base, trying to run home. Pandarian Brewmaster now sitting at, um, what, 730 hit points. So still has a good amount of hit points. And now we're going to have this fight underway. Dragonhawk Rider, still no upgrades, and quickly f runs across the destroyer. That destroyer trying to run for his life. Mountain King out in front, wanting to make sure that he's able to bolt that Pandarian Brewmaster to avoid any unnecessary casualties from that Breath of Fire. But the Pandarian Brewmaster, really, really strong right now. Probably has level 3 Drunken Brawler, level 3 uh, Breath of Fire, and, and the Earth, Earth Storm and Fire right now. Now we have um, a single Dragonhawk Rider, very, very slow, trying to come in. 
Ghouls trying to run back into the base as well. Trying to run back around. Let's see if it's really going to work. Mount and what Dragonhawk Riders trying to stand back. Perhaps we'll get more Scrolls of Healing. Mount King has a Scroll of Healing. And the Archmage has a Scroll of Healing as well. Obsidian Statue is running the gauntlet right now. Trying to survive. Getting bashed. Very, very lucky getting a bash off on that Mountain King to take down that Obsidian Statue. And now once again trying to move back out. We're going to know no Devour Magic on that Water Elemental. A little bit surprised by that. Perhaps we're just trying to get into range. If they can get into range with that Unholy Aura underneath. More ghouls? No. Yeah, a single ghoul in the base over there. Able to take down that one... Um, one water elemental. So what? Pandarian Brewmaster level seven. Death Knight level three. Almost level. No, level two. Almost level three. Archmage going to get to level six. And now water elemental quickly coming out, trying to take focus down that Archmage. Archmage getting focused down. Level three on the Death Knight right now. Death, Death Knight now trying to run away. Gonna get a bolt off. Oh no! That Death Knight's gonna fall. So Death Knight desperately needs to run away. Not gonna be able to really get anywhere. That Mountain King's cooldown is just around that corner. Gonna try to get a potion of healing, and then try. To do a death coil, yet no, able to use the potion of healing just in time. The death knight would have gone down. Perhaps he's going to try to use a death coil. Oh, nice potion of invulnerability. And he's biting a scroll of town portal, town portaling to the far side. That mountain king doesn't know where he's going to be. And now Archmage, oh, Archmage is down to 52 hit points. Those Dragonhawk Destroyers um, 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 able to take down some of those um, some of those Destroyers. Those Dragonhawk Riders able to take down some of those Destroyers, excuse me. Pandurian Brewmaster getting another breath of fire off. Down goes another Peasant, uh, trying to finish off these Peasants. Archmage coming back in, and Pandurian Brewmaster coming in as well. So those Dragonhawk Riders trying to chase down those Destroyers. That's a good amount of Dragonhawk Riders, I think. I can't tell they're stacked so much, they're almost like Mutalist right now. I think it's about 7, and now no, it's probably like... Wow, that's almost a full control group of Dragonhawk Riders. I think that's close to 10. Death Knight, very low on hit points. Gonna, is he going to be able to use a Potion of Healing? No, unable to use that Potion of Healing. Really, really badly played by um, Maxwell in that particular instance right now. Dr and Dragonhawk Riders still taking damage from those towers right now. And now the Archmage with um, mass teleportation will be able to move around the map really, really quickly. And now the game's just slowly, slowly transitioning over to Maxwell. I think Maxwell is going to get this game. At this point, there's not much that... Uh, um, that Oh, sorry. Um, Kaz is going to take this game. I don't think Maxwell can really do anything about this. He has an expansion over here. Still no towers, unfortunately. But um, he does have an expansion, so both players are pretty much even economically. Pandurian Brewmaster still sitting at level 7. Needs to really change up his strategy. Perhaps get some Fiends and some Web to try to immobilize that army. Now getting a Death Knight back in as well. So... Not quite sure how what's going to happen here. The Mountain King wants to get to level 5. Level 5 Mountain King would be really, really bad news for Maxwell, as level 3 Stormbolt would now come into play. Pandurian Brewmaster just sitting in his own base, um, Destroyer hovering above um, that Blight in order to, to regenerate some hit points. Archmage now coming in as well, perhaps going to try to do some creeping over here. Going to drop a Water Elemental in just a second, and the Mountain King will be really close to level 5 if the Archmage pulls back, and it is going to pull back indeed. But Pandarian Brewmaster is still trying to run around. Well, both players are just not really doing much. I can try to make it sound more exciting. Talk really, really fast about the creeping. But the Mountain King is just doing some creeping. Shade is following. And still waiting for the Archmage or some one, one player to really initiate this final battle right now. Both players just trying to hold off him a little bit. Maxwell needing his Death Knight. Mountain King wanting to get to level 5 and is now at level 5. So level 5 on that Mountain King, it's going to be much more difficult to really take down the rest of this fight right now. Dragonhawk Riders, uh, Scroll of Healing being, um, being used. And now that Mountain King going to try to pick up an, an additional Scroll of Healing most likely. Mantle of Intelligence being left a long time ago by... Um, by Maxwell, so we'll see. No, not going to pick it up. Archmage going to pick it up instead. And now those towers quickly trying to take down some of those units. N Mountain King getting a bolt off on the Death Knight. Death Knight low on hit points, but doesn't have to worry too much. Trying to run to the back of the base. Getting bashed once more. Do we have the Pandurian Brewmaster? Pandurian Brewmaster up to the north, taking down the expansion over here. Does have a staff of teleportation. Should probably try to teleport back down to the south side, but not going to be teleporting. Um, Death Knight, I think I heard the Death Knight fall. No, the Death Knight did not fall. And now Pandurian Brewmaster is coming back in. Nice breath of fire, taking down one Dragonhawk Rider really, really quickly. Now trying to use a um, staff of um, what, um, mass teleportation, but able to take down an additional... Um, an additional Dragonhawk Rider with, from the help of those Spirit Towers. So level 8 on the Pandurian Brewmaster right now. And yes, the Death Knight did fall. Death Knight fell at level 3. So 
Um, yeah, I was waiting for the caption here, but I didn't see it, but I forgot I'm not in observer mode. Um, right now, the Dragonhawk Rider is once again trying to move back out. Still no um, castle right now, so those that Breath of Fire is still extremely effective against those low hit point Dragon Riders. Stay tuned for part 3 and the conclusion of this replay to between Maxwell and Poker off Kaz here on Terranus Stand.